assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh good evening friends in last video we see how we can create the invoice and how we can post the invoice and in this video we can see how we can reverse the invoice purchase invoice and what is the effect of the jv in that in that and also in this video i also did another thing in last video we were actually creating single entry of the product for example i show you here this is my invoice i last created here actually three products are showing 300 275 to 25 for example last uh, seven number no another one i select latest one this one no 10 number invoice number 10 so here actually three products but in last video we see we are actually putting the submit submission of that in jv we can see the jv here only the current total in inventory the total debit amount is showing all products but at now today i will show you how we can split that one for example we have three products so it will debit three items for each product and credit it only one entry for vendor so first i will create the invoice new invoice i will create 12 number invoice any party name like blue chip here you can select the product red of bags 80 kg bags quantity 5 rate 15 add new line another product onion bag bags 3 rice 12 now total here how many product two products one amount 75 136 before it was going some of the product in inventory inventory account na uh, in current asset account now we can we it will be split it so i will show you where another browser i will open here i created the invoice number 12 it is showing invoice number 12 here down side just i created this invoice so here we have to post this invoice in jv we can see what is showing watch our list it will come here down side so i will go here i will post it is successfully posted refresh jv number 7 here you see it is splitting the product amount 75 and 36 what is in which is in invoice 75 36 and here it is showing the narration narration i also maybe increase the narration i will put the quantity also because our chart of account is actually three level chart of account i am using if we are using the hierarchical chart chart of account or four level five level then we can also define define the product code also in our chart of account but i am actually simply i am making this for testing this three level normal it is normal if we we want details so we can take the print out from inventory from purchased module no? so that's why i created the three level chart of account so it's just in narration i am showing showing the product so here debit and credit is equal 75 36 so double entry created now this is one thing which i created and for for that what i did i show you in view we are posting the invoice uh, this one this is this actually view is for posting the invoice p i n v post just simply what i did here actually i i was already i just put the loop in our field and our query set na no? this purchase invoice detail it is actually our query set we are it is the detail of purchase invoice which it is query set we are calling here purchase invoice filter 
so what I did just I put the loop here for I in purchase invoice detail other things all same only where I did the change inst instance the narration here I put the product name also even I can product put the product quantity also like this uh, plus some space product quantity i dot qty so quantity will also show no problem even rate will also show we can see so but no need this is just for testing debit amount I change here the amount I dot amount yani for example which amount is coming here before it was coming the total amount na, and aggregated amount I was creating the aggregated amount here upside this one INV amount aggregated amount based on the PK primary key I was doing the sum of the amount but now I am not putting the sum I in, in our QD set loop I am using the simple multiple amounts here so amount one amount 75 one amount 36 like here it is coming so that's changes is for this how to we can create split the how we can split our entry in JV now second thing the reverse before reverse was already created but I put another condition if because now you see if we can put the reverse now so here I already posted this one JV number invoice number 12 so it is not showing in our list why it is not showing because I put their condition command for this one purchase invoice 12 number posted by date posted by user and posted by date and time so we have to update this one blank then it will come again here in our list 12 invoice number 12 so what I did for that one I first I show you I will reverse this one this entry reverse it is reverse number 3 JV number 3 reverse this reverse entry created here so now it will show in our list now you see now 11 number is coming now I can refresh 12 number is also coming showing here so it is reverse and again invoice is updated and you see here refresh it is blank so what I did for that one in posting view JV posting view reverse JV view sorry just I put end here I put I call here the here I will get the instance of the invoice number purchase invoice object get invoice number is equal to x dot reference number what is the x dot reference number this one this number because this number will be same no? like this one x dot reference number I will take this one if invoice number and it is true then inv dot posted is equal to none posted that is equal to none invoice dot save is equal to that this is actually variable like it or object you can say and message will send the reverse journal entry successfully reverse so now up to here it is finished thank you very much so same thing inshallah I will try to do that in sales in sales system we can do the same thing for reverse now it is purchase reverse and sales entry we can create sales invoice also and also I have to create for example for We have to create some dashboard here and also a ledger and trial balance. So you can keep continue to watch the videos. I have very short times and I also have to work in Oracle Apex also. So that's why I have less time and I will try to do what is possible. Thank you very much. Good good evening. Allah Hafiz. Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.